Hi, I'm Mick LaSalle, the film critic for the San Francisco Chronicle. You know, when you go to the film festivals, let's say you go to Sundance, you go to Berlin, when you go to you, with Sundance, it's absolutely freezing. You walk in your boots to trudge over to some bus, and you get on the bus, and everybody smells like coffee, and then you go to the movie theater, and you start watching a movie, and just as you're beginning to defrost, just as, you, as you're beginning to get, to get warm, you realize that the movie is bad. Same thing in Berlin. If you go to Berlin, it's absolutely freezing. It's in February in Berlin. It's snowing, you get to the theater, and a half hour later, you warm up, you realize the movie is bad. So what do you do? Do you go back out to the cold? Or you just stay there in the warm theater? Most of the time, you just stay in the warm theater. But at the Venice Film Festival, if the movie is bad, we'll take a look. I mean, a movie, in fact, has to be pretty good for you to even want to stay in your seat. Well, what does that mean? It means that the movies at Venice have to be really good. And this year, for the first time, 2016, this is the first time I haven't walked out of a single movie in Venice. All right, now, later today, I'm going to be going over to, um, I'm gonna go over to the, to the Lido, and I'm gonna see a couple of things. Uh, the one I'm looking forward to seeing is Un V. It's the latest film by Stéphane Brise, French filmmaker. And I'm gonna let you know what I think of that after I've seen it. Maybe we'll take a look, see some of the sights around there. All right. I'm at Un V. Uh, there was a, a really bad rainstorm about, uh, about an hour, no, no, but 10 minutes ago, when we were talking about it, and it was going on, it started an hour ago, and it just stopped. And so this is turning the um, red carpet for Unvi into the most depressing red carpet I've ever seen. Let's take a look. I mean, very few people are here. That, if that looks like a crowd, that's not the usual thing. As you can see over here, these people are actually, like that guy, Okay, well, earlier today I said that I haven't walked out of a movie in Venice Film Festival, and unfortunately I wound up walking out of this one because I fell asleep. This movie, Un V by Stéphane Brise, he's a very good, conscientious filmmaker, but this movie adopts a very strange strategy of skipping over the dramatic parts and then showing you the boring parts. For example, at one point there's a double murder-suicide, right? And you don't see that part, you just see like maybe like a brief flash of the aftermath and then it goes right into a boring, another boring conversation. And so I, I was in a trance. I wound up falling asleep and I thought, well, why stick around that pretense? Anyway, if I have to review this, obviously I'll watch the whole thing, but maybe I'll get lucky and it won't get released in the United States. Anyway, for the San Francisco Chronicle, I'm Nicholas Sal.